Welcome to TechQuest channel. This is for the tech by ear tech. Today's video we will see what is cum serum, anti-human serum. ABO blood type antibodies are naturally occurring antibodies. When the antigen is not present, the corresponding antibodies are present in the plasma. Other blood type antibodies are not produced naturally when the antigen is not present. But when the antigen is presented later, immune system produce the antibodies. Usually, blood transfusion or pregnancy can induce this antibody production. These antibodies are called unexpected or atypical or ILO antibodies. They are normally IgG type. Examples are anti-D, anti-C, anti, anti, anti IgG antibodies do not cause agglutination in saline medium. They can only attach to the antigen and cause sensitization. It cannot be detected in regular test microscopically because it's only sensitized, not complete agglutination. Anti-human globulin test or hemagglutination test. The anti-human globulin attach these sensitized cells together and cause agglutination. To detect these antibodies, anti-human globulin, the cum serum is used. Moasi first described the use of anti-human globulin in 1908. Robert Royston Amos Coombs rediscovered the test, the method in 1945, that's why it's called Coombs serum or Coombs test. Polyspecific anti-human globulin contains anti-human globulin IgG type and anti-complement 3B and anti-complement 3D. When human IgG antibodies are immunized to rabbits, they produce antibodies to human IgG. IgM anti complement 3D are produced from mouse spleen cells by immunizing them. The anti IgG component contains antibodies reactivity against light IgG chains so that it can also agglutinate with IgA and IgM coated RBCs. The blend is maintained in bovine albumin based buffered solution. Ereoglucins and naphthal yellow, yes is added for green color in some company reagents. Polyspecific reagent contains anti-human IgG antibodies, anti-complement 3B, complement 3C, complement 3D. Monospecific reagents are also available for each anti-human antibodies for specific antibody detection. How to test the anti-human globulin is working. The control has to be done every day it should be tested with IgG coated RBCs and if possible complement coated and non coated RBCs respectively. Positive control add one drop of cum serum and one drop of washed cum's control cells. It should give you uh, agglutination microscopically or macroscopically or hemolysis. The negative control anti human globulin that is cum serum one drop and one drop of washed O pool cells. It should give negative results, that is no agglutination. Then we have to add one drop of Coombs control cells and it should give a positive result that validates the test. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe for more videos. Thank you.